Many businesses have been impacted by COVID-19, and depending on where you live, your business may still be recovering. To help speed up the process and help get back to business as usual, consider using Shopify's online tipping feature. This feature was originally introduced back in May of 2020, and it allows your customers to add a tip at checkout while showing their support for you and your business. Before we get started, be sure to subscribe to the East Door Kings YouTube channel for more Shopify tutorials, as well as tips and tricks on practical ways to grow your business online. To set up the tipping option in your Shopify cart, head on over to settings in your Shopify admin. From there, we're gonna click on checkout and then scroll all the way down the page until you see the tipping section. Go ahead and click on the show tipping options at checkout checkbox. You will now see a second checkbox along with three different tipping options. If you leave the show tip options to all customers checkbox checked off, it will show the tip options to all customers. If you deselect this checkbox, only customers who choose to add a tip will see the options. So go ahead and either check or uncheck this box, whichever works best for you. I'm going to go ahead and check it off for this example. Next, enter the percentage amounts that you would like to offer as your tipping options for your customers. Do keep in mind that 100% is the maximum percentage. You can't change it to something ridiculous like 800%. So go ahead and enter the amounts that you'd like. Once you're done entering your percentage amounts, go ahead and scroll all the way down to the bottom of the page and hit the save button. Now, when we add a few items to our cart and make our way through the checkout process, our brand new tipping options will be available. And as you can see here, it's super easy to select a tip option and we can even add a custom tip here. And there it is, our tip has been added to our order. Tipping really is a great feature and it doesn't hurt to turn it on. Customers can simply skip over it if they aren't interested, or you'll end up making additional money on an order that you otherwise wouldn't have. If you found this Shopify tutorial helpful, please do give it a like and subscribe, and stay tuned for more ways to enhance your Shopify store.